hi welcome to all in this section we will talk about uh, how to fill the basic details in the gate examination for that you have to first just enter in google gate 2024 then it will be appearing link like this then just click in this link then page is going to open like this after that just a scroll down then you can see view details after that you can get the activity different types of information so you will get in this gate online application system open that you have to click then the window appear like this first time you are going to registration for this enter the basic details in the bottom already you are registered that login id details and password you can enter and then you will allow the inside filling the details of your personal and uploading your documentation process first time registration means you have to click registration here then fill your name after filling of your basic details you have to check whether you are filled correct spelling of your name and surname or else uh, in future you going to face the problem once you for you generated the gate score that uh, competitive uh, PUC sector or any government jobs eligibility time you have to show your gate rank card that time your name same to the your qualification certificates as well as the gate rank card or else uh, it is a problem for you for that you have to one or two times verify carefully then go for the next step okay then it's showing like this just a confirmation your name is correct or not you have to check it and then click continue then it will be asked your personal mail id that mail id you have to fill here then automatically it will be take the country if you are out of uh, country just select other then check your mobile number then confirm your mobile number personal secure password this password you have to remind and recollect for the re-login purpose again you have to fill the application form carefully then click the registration then it will be shows registration successfully completed then registration confirmation you will get through mail as well as the message through your phone okay then click continue then it will be showing whatever details you are given there you have to fill here 
mail id or else you have to give your enrollment id that you will get from mail and as well as the message by use that id or mail id also you can use it and your password you have to enter then click login then it shows application status before starting the gate 2024 application please ensure that you have read the gate 2024 information brochure and you have document and data requirement to filling applications okay you have to go through that and you know uh, what are the documents are required documentation sizes how much is required signature and photo what are the formats you have to upload everything you will get from the brochure that you have to read one time then proceed for the next process start application filling then it will be appearing like this in this uh, you have to enter first they are divided into six sections in that six sections first section related to exam you have to select the exam center in this don't confuse here they are given two options option one option two if you are appearing for two papers that time you have to fill the second one also if you are appearing only one paper that time you have to give the one exam center details select that paper here then priority wise uh, very nearest center you have to select first after that uh, far away centers you have to choose two centers within your range uh, third center that is your choice wherever you want to select you can select it okay uh, the details you have to fill it these centers they will give option also now you are filling some uh, centers after that uh, they will give the options uh, to modify the centers that time you have to modify if you want modified you can modify it no issues or else just keep that original data as it is after that save these details and go for the next then you will get the information like this your name is showing not full fledged then you just fill the complete name okay name to appear on the admit card as it is uh, your 10th class may be your uh, BE qualification or BTEC qualification how it will be you have to fill as it is same ok then confirm your name ok after that here you have to do uh, mail id verification as well as the mobile number verification then you just click here you will get the code that code you have to enter here automatically your mail id as well as uh, mobile number also verified something it will be show green color then after that you have to fill the your date of birth details and gender and nationality and category your belongs to which category that category you have to select it okay and then after any disabilities means you have to choose or automatically it will be no no option it will be shows okay then after that basic information whatever information is required you have to fill if you are selecting other that id number you have to mention and guardian and this all general information you have to fill compulsory then save next Okay, then it will go for the address section in that address section what is your permanent address that address you have to 
right in this boxes okay after that save and go for the next then it will become like this degree details okay every college they have the code in that code either you know just uh, uh, enter that code you don't know means just uh, search in google or maybe directly you can ask management uh, they will give the code college code that code you have to enter here then select the college and select the city of the college and your uh, id card registration number or roll number any number you have to enter uh, your currently study or qualifying whatever degree you have to select here then you already completed just click here now currently you are final year that you have to select okay then name of the university then college name then save and next then you have to upload your document what are the documents it is required photography is required a systematic format okay in these sizes you have to modify your image and then upload that image properly this is the one of the major important uh, documentation process my sincere request suggestion for you please check three or four times whether suitable format photo you are uploading or not okay or else your application going to reject again you have to upload next time again rejecting means they don't consider for the writing examination so please be aware of this particular section you have to be carefully select the things in the next video i will show you complete filling application form and uploading document details i will show that time i will tell you how to modify the images and how to modify the signatures that and all okay then this is the normal condition where any one option you have to choose and save view the application details and review the application before submitting your application you have to go through your complete details okay all the details are you filled properly you are satisfied with that all details just to go for the next step declaration step in the declaration step you have to declare yes above mention all the details are corrected like that you have to choose tick mark and save the application and final step you have to submit the application then it will be appear the application fees that details you have to enter just to pay that amount through any payment method then now your application process is going to complete after that you have to download your complete application for the further future use purpose whether you going to join in the higher course or maybe any uh, pus sector jobs or any thing you have to show this application form this is compulsory you have to save uh, in google or maybe in your personal phone or somewhere else keep that in save mode after that also you can download it from this website there is no issue but save sake you have to take that copy and save somewhere else okay thank you all